Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Okay, I'm Faizata Siyanti Ghazali. Okay, and with our team, um, this is uh, regarding our research. Okay, this is a project of our university grant. Okay, so the topic is a purpose, a proposed a web-based academic audit system, a case study of UNISHAM. Okay, as we know, okay, information technology is essential, okay, in this uh, digital age. Okay, higher education institution is also the advantage of IT, okay, in order to perform the academic services. Okay, so the function of higher education institution is to carry out education properly. Okay, so this is the main priority. Okay, so uh, there are three main process of academic service, uh, which is um, teaching, uh, research and internal and external service. Okay, so uh, auditing is important to increase the performance and higher education if, uh, institution in Malaysia mostly focus on institutional audit okay, to get insurance, to get assurance process. Okay, and internal quality audit is conducted uh, which is a self-review exercise. That one is to enhance the quality. Okay, so uh, our focus is for UNISHAMS. Okay, okay UNISHAMS stands for University Islam Antarabangsa Sutta Abdul Halim Mu'azzam Shah, which is situated okay, at uh, Kuala Ketil, Kedah. Okay, so UNISHAMS also con conducts okay, an audit institutional for MQA audit program and then SETARA and also the Internal Academy Audit Control. Okay, so UNISHAM recently conducts uh, audit exercise using traditional approach. Okay, and then um, and a certain tension is found. Okay, some appears of the debate uh, occur, some mistake and unethical activity while doing uh, audit work. Okay, means that when we use the traditional approach, it means that um, we use the uh, manual and manual document. Okay, so and then to overcome the problem related to UNISHAM's academic audit, okay, research audit, our research audit is to propose a web-based information system to ensure continuity of the information technology with the implementation of web-based academic audit. Okay. So, this is the um, literature review regarding the audit information web-based system. Okay, so we know, okay, uh, auditing information system, okay, is auditing is still particularly important to increase the performance of information system. Okay, and then uh, the objective of um, audit information system is to formulate an opinion about the effectiveness and the contribution of um, IS okay, to organizations and then the purpose okay, of the um, uh, IS okay, is that the functions uh, of auditor is to identify risk and evaluate the uh, adequacy of the control of a critical information system and also the process is uh, to collect and evaluating evidence to determine if the computer system safeguard maintaining data integrity organizational goals to be achieved and uh, use sources uh, efficiently. Okay, so this is our research design. Okay, this is a combination of descriptive study that describes the phenomenon on the on an event and exploratory study that develops a model of web-based academic audit system. Okay, so we develop the purpose of the web-based academic system uh, based using the waterfall model, okay, which is um, based on the uh, literature study, okay, we are, we, we are using uh, five pages, okay, five pages uh, on the, um, using the waterfall model, okay, which is a literature review, literature study, okay, that one is, uh, this stage is, uh, we study all the document, okay, uh, relevant to the, our topic, okay, and then, uh, the second phase is analysis phase, Okay, which is uh, we define the problem okay, to determine okay, the scope of the system and then uh, as well as mapping the system requirement uh, specifications and also we, the third stage is the design stage that one is the purpose uh, system. 
Okay, so we purpose uh, to pro we, we provide the overview okay, on what should be done and how the user interface look. Okay, and then uh, the page help to specify the hardware and system requirement and we define the overall system architecture. Okay, and then also coding paste. Okay, for the coding paste is a is a programming, and uh, we use the technology or the system. Okay, and then um, the one we build the simple and easy for users to understand. Okay, so and then uh, lastly is the stage of the uh, testing. Okay, testing stage. Okay, that one is um, uh, we have the we include the process of implementing okay, the system that was built. Okay, so this one is our research design. Okay, so the result. Okay, for the result, okay, um, we establish uh, establishment of the purpose simulation tool system on the web based academy audit system for Unisham. Okay, so we come up with the two uh, steps which is a, a system design and also system implementation. Okay, for the system design, okay, um, for the system design, um, we have the uh, flowchart document. Okay, uh, and then we have the audit application virtual table of the content diagram and we build the system login flowchart and then we build the audit uh, we plot the audit flow chart. Okay, for the system implementation, okay, we have the uh, login menu, uh, users uh, list page, and then we have the audit list page, and domain register page, and domain class, uh, data input page, and audit valid validation page, and then we have the uh, audit result page, and um, we have the uh, report statistic pages and also lastly is for the um, system test okay so the one is for result okay then lastly is the conclusion okay and everything the result and discussion we discuss uh, detail more detail on the um, our article Okay, so uh, the, for the conclusion, um, our purpose uh, web-based audit system, uh, audit academic system will help an academic audit committee of UNISHAM in structuring the audit process using web-based audit system by providing the information on test data regarding the assessment and recommendations of audit result. Okay, so that's all and thank you. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.